Welcome back. While some teams are in postseason play already, others have one last chance to improve their standing in their respective league tables. That's the case on the Hill this weekend as the Bulldogs welcome the Louisiana schools, Grambling State and Southern to town for women's men's double headers. Tonight they took on the Tigers. They'll save the Jags for Saturday. You see Margaret Richards having a chat with her senior leader, Amaya Simmons, early in this one. About four minutes to go in the first period. Graham up 12-9. Darian Bergen gets it at the top of the key. Swings around to the far side, back around to Burgeon. Three ball is up and in. Dogs down just one now. Graham was especially good about feeding the post. And even against great defense here by Kayla Turner, you'd see the Tigers are still able to get it down on the low block. It's Anijah Grant receiving the pass on the low block right there. One dribble. Ooh, nice take to the rack. Right place, right time for two. It's 16-11 with under a minute to go in the first at that point. Now, getting back in this game will require generating points and, and doing it quickly. And one of the best ways to do that is drawing and ones. You see Alicia Wilson there doing it there. She moves the margin to five at 18-13, but can't get any closer as she missed the free throw. A&M lost any sort of groove they had in the second period, making just three of 14 from the floor. They wind up with 11 points and go down 39-22 at the half. Fourth quarter push, not enough. Bulldogs drop this one 60-55. And they got one more game to go. All right, the men had even more on the line. With a win or an Alabama State loss, they'd clinch the top, uh, clinch a spot rather in the SWAC tournament. The Bulldogs couldn't close this one out, but Bama State did lose to Southern, which means A&M has clinched a spot in the SWAC tournament. And up next is the regular season finale for the Bulldogs. It'll be senior day against the Southern Jags. The women are trying to climb out of the fifth spot in their table. They need some help from the rest of the league. Like I said, the men are already in the tournament. They're trying to move into seventh place, which they can do with a win plus an Alabama state loss.